you what happened? Well, I was reading in bed, and the air conditioning was on. I must have fallen asleep, punched over my book, because I woke up like this. Mm -hmm. Is that a good mm, no, I'm or not. a bad one? <laughs> May I? Oh, please. That is the best offer I've had in weeks. Mm, I haven't doubt that. All right. Uh, I'm sorry. Um, tell me what you're doing. I'm just going to try to work on the muscle and loosen up the neck a little bit. Okay. Is that going to hurt? No, no. Just the muscle. Okay. You know, that's what the tightness is. So what was the book you were reading? Oh, book? Mm -hmm, you know, the thing with pages. You said you fell asleep on it. Oh, uh, well, truth, it was a fashion magazine. Uh, girls got to stay current. Oh, oh, nice hands. Thank you. Yeah, uh, so, what's it like, uh, living with Greenlee? That's, you know, fun. <laughs> In a high-maintenance mini diva kind of way. Oh, oh, hey! What the hell kind of doctor are you? I, I should have known you're too hot to be any good. How's an act? <laughs> wow. What are you, some kind of miracle worker? <laughs> ah. Ah. Uh, right, right here. I oh. think that, yeah, that, I think there's a little, more. a little kink. Right in here? Right, yeah, right, right. How's this? Mm. Yeah? Mm, that's good. Yeah? Slow morning. I haven't had my Frankie sighting yet. You call Dr. Hubbard Frankie? In my dreams. He's so hot. I swear he gave you a look once. Yeah, I dropped a bottle of meds all over the floor. Not that kind of look, a look look. Mm, well, I'll keep dreaming. And I better get these requisitions to supply. Uh, Jill? Yes, Dr. Hubbard. May I have a word with you? Randy, what happened to you in the past, that doesn't define who you are. Are we done with this form? You know what I see when I look at you? What? I'm a beautiful girl? You think you're the first to mention it? I see a young woman who loves pistachio ice cream, who closes her eyes and leans into the sun when she thinks nobody's watching. Look at her. See her every day. No, you don't. You shut down and you shut off. But you got to break through that wall because you're in there, Randy. You. And you're amazing. And I bet if you look hard enough, you'll see what I see and you'll find her. All that sweet talk, I just filled out the form myself. Well, wow. But I'll take it. We're making progress. You didn't slap me and you didn't walk away. I still can't figure you out. Uh, me either. I'll see you later. Yeah. Whether I like it or not, right? Hey, Doc. Thanks. Ryan? You okay? It was, uh... That was nothing. You sure? Because it seemed like a whole lot of something. <laughs> We've been through a lot. The whole thing with Richie. Now Annie's pregnant. You got your memory back. If you need to talk about any of it, I'm here. Maybe it's time to pack it in, party people. Days a bust. Not all of it. You were right, Pete. You, you hear that? He said I was right. You should listen up. Uh, about what? What happened with Novak? It's done. Can't be undone. But what we can do is some damage control. We got to think about our families. My dad and his campaign. Your stepdad, your mom. It'd be a hell of a hit for them to take if the truth came out. Everybody gets outed. I'm toast. 
Your dad will hunt me down. He's protective that way. Doesn't he get it? No way I'd do anything to hurt you. No one wants to hurt anybody. So, are we really all in this together? I'm sorry it turned out like this. But it's my turn, Richie, and I can't have you messing with that. And now, with a baby on the way, it's, it's meant to be. What happened will be our little secret. I'm moving on with my life now, Richie. A life that I want and that I deserve with a man that I love. And our children. You have no more power over me.